Now, suppose I actually have it, okay? Mm -hmm. Suppose, let's just take the leap of faith and say, I have an underactive thyroid, which would explain a lot. What are some things I can start to do, lifestyle interventions, that can help the root cause? Like you're in, you know, other than, I mean, they're all in the book, so get the book, everyone, but what can people who are watching who have a low thyroid do right now? Today. So without your doctor, so there's a ton of information there about getting on optimal thyroid medications, which in some cases are going to be necessary and very helpful. Mm -hmm. And Synthroid is not the best medication for everybody. So I find that majority of people that I correspond with or that are my clients um, that have come through my pharmacy or that have come through you know, my programs or consulting. There's other options. Yeah, they do better on different types of medications that perhaps contain um, Dif a mixture of thyroid hormones, not just one thyroid hormone, which is what Synthroid has. But the things you can do on your own without yeah. needing your doctor's supervision are gonna be really looking at your nutrition. So what kind of food are you eating? Mm. Majority of people that I've surveyed and that I've worked with, 90% of them are gonna feel much, much better off of gluten. So I've seen miracle stories. So no grain. No grains, no grain, no pain. But I've seen miracle stories of women. Um, I had one woman who was an equestrian and she lived on this gorgeous farm with her horses. And she wrote to me after reading my book and said, your book has changed my life. I you know, changed my diet the way that you recommended. And for the first time in five years, I have enough energy to take care of my horses and ride my horses. So this woman loved her horses, but had to pay somebody to take care of them and wasn't able to ride them for almost five years because she was so exhausted and just changing her diet up mm. resulted in her having her passion back. And I bet she had, I bet she didn't have to take as much thyroid medicine. Oftentimes or maybe that even, happens. I wonder Oftentimes if you could come happens. off of certain medications if your thyroid, you know, if you're just getting better and better from diet and exercise and some of your other, what's another one that people can do? Another one is getting off of dairy. So dairy is probably the second biggest trigger for people with um, thyroid issues. About 80% of my people feel much, much better off of dairy. And so you'll see things, um, my story is I had irritable bowel syndrome and I had acid reflux. Mm -hmm. um, my acid reflux kept me awake um, most nights because I would wake up coughing. Sometimes I would have to, I'd be talking to a patient at a pharmacy, I'd have to start coughing so hard, I'd have to run back and you know vomit in the bathroom because oh I had God. this horrible acid reflux and I was on over-the-counter medications, I was on prescription medications, I was doing the recommended acid reflux diet, doing all those things, nothing helped hmm. for three years. Three years. And within three days of getting off of dairy, gone. My gone. acid reflux, I haven't had it for five years. I'm off of every single acid reflux medication. And it was just a miracle story. And these are the things that happen when people just switch their diet around. So two easy things, no gluten, no dairy. Right. And then um, I actually have a guide how to go gluten free and dairy free on my website under the thyroidpharmacist.com slash gift to Good. make it really easy for you because there's really simple substitutions. I want everyone to go and download that right now because I mean, it, it's going to help your thyroid first of all, but it, I think that that can help other issues as well. It could prevent disease. So you can slow down the progression of the condition. You can reverse the condition. Like you said, some people um, some people are able to reduce their dosage of medications. Others can come off of the medications. Um, either way, everybody feels better whether or not they stay on their medication. So this is something you can do in addition to working and with your doctor.